Um, I was thinking uh, just a second ago there that, uh, that the context for our Lenten season and Lenten practice has been racial reconciliation in particular, or in things that might inform our thinking mm -hmm. on that. And uh, I can't think of something more appropriate to be happening in this day and in this age. I teach African American history, mm -hmm. so I do this all the, all, the, all the time, but if you thoughtful about race in America. One, one thing that you can't disagree with, I don't think, is that a blessing to come together and to even think about how mm -hmm. to reckon with mm -hmm. it. That's, that's even before yeah. actually right. reckoning yeah. with yeah. it, which is something that the, that, yeah. that the nation um, needs to do now mm -hmm. more than ever. I'm just thinking too, this is, uh, I never saw this distinction before, uh, but it makes sense that you can't really have reconciliation until you reckon with. Yeah. You got to reckon with. Yeah. And that doesn't mean you're reconciled. That means you're reckoning with mm -hmm. the, you know, what needs to be reckoned with. Right. You know, with, with, within oneself, but also within one's community, whether that's a local church or a nation.